I came here to chase down one of the most popular desserts from the area to bring you down closer to the culture. A very popular place and it has one of the most iconic desserts you can find here. We came behind the scenes. This is crazy. Come check this out. This is where the magic happened. And it will take them around three hours to complete the whole process. But here is the question. What is this and why is it so special? You come here and you have to try it right away. Here we heard of a family that has been for years making and selling this delicacy. Something that has been going on generations after generations. Halwa is the name of it, translating to something sweet. A Middle Eastern dessert that is also very popular on the island of Zanzibar. And this family is based here in Pemba Island, making it in their own unique way and calling it Wete Halwa. As we got behind the scenes, I had to check on where it all happened. This is crazy. Come check this out. This is where the magic happens. And the making process starts with mixing water and unrefined sugar. All of it cooked not with gas, but as traditionally was with firewood. And this man here is handling the operation at the back to make the work more efficient. <laughs> But as the mixture gets cooked inside, the mixture is then added with some spices, butter, nuts and some broth water to add to its unique flavor. Every day, tens of kilograms of halwa are cooked, packed, served and sold on their shop, where people going to buy, take away and some of them try it on the go. And why it is special, you ask? It is eaten during many occasions, but especially as an offering while serving guests. These kind of things immerse you more with the local experience, what people eat, what people have, and how people make them. This is such an incredible experience. With different bread qualities and packed in several different ways, this traditional packaging is their signature style known by most people. It allows for a better taste and helps in absorbing the oil and making it dry upon eating. And having a cup of coffee on the side goes really, really well with halwa. They cook it right here in a place behind and then here is where they come and pack and sell. People come here by wholesale, retail. Getting the behind the scenes of how everything happens, coming here, friendly people, people are smiling, people are very, very welcoming. This is definitely a must visit for people coming to these islands. It's such an amazing experience. Karibuni sana Pemba, karibuni wete na karibuni Bin Hamid Halwa na kuonja halua ya wete. Ni mwanamke.